Sorry, Fred. Uh, we have here in this hospital two operations room. This is the first one. Usually in the field hospitals all over Syria, the operation rooms uh, will be minus one or minus two floors. The surgeons need to be uh, focused, not need to concentrate uh, on the patient, and their hands can be shaked by uh, an explosion, explosive or a, a strike, an air strike. So that's why uh, we put the operation rooms uh, underground. The, the, the field hospitals are always targeted. It's a very, very, very difficult thing to deal, to deal with. You need to be focused, you need to concentrate on patient, and also you are, you are scared, you are afraid to be uh, targeted, to be hit at any, any time. Nowadays in Aleppo city, there are not more than 25 doctors covering the, the whole city, giving uh, me medical service for about 300,000 uh, civilians. We decide to stay in Aleppo to help the people here, but uh, we can't have enough medical supplies to help to serve that uh, number of people. We are speaking about only two months, not more than three months maximum. So after that, we will be helpless. We can't do anything.